Okay, so yun. Kita na, kita na yung board natin. Okay na, kita na guys. Videos on sa iba. Nasa nandito si Gwen. Video on, Gwen. Naririnig ba ako guys? Naririnig ako? Rinig sir, rinig. Okay, good. So, yan. Videos on tayo. Yung mga pwede mag-vid. Ninyo, ikaw, ninyo. Nakaraan, ano? Yan. Okay. No, may pin repair ako kasi di ba meron tayong dinasagutan last time. Pero mamaya nalang balikan. Diretso na muna ako sa lesson today. So, lesson today ay APLA, coming in. And so, kakasimula lang. Uh, integration by So, I decided to nahin doon, no? Partial fractions. Tapos, uh, outline lang natin, uh, outline. Bago ko i-outline, mag-example muna ako. Kanyari, example. Kanyari, ito yung integral. Let's say, x squared minus uh, 3x plus... 1. Tapos, uh, okay natin plus 2. Pwede naman. And then, what's here? Kunyari, 2x minus 3 dx. So, obviously, ang integral natin dito involves a rational function para ma-apply yung technique. Kasi nga, fraction. Okay? So, rational. Kung papansin nyo, this is, can be easily done by substitution. Andali. Kasi nga, pag nilet ko yung, yung denominator, Pag nilet ko yung denominator as u, ang du ay, ano yung du? 2x minus 3. Right? 2x minus 3. And then, huwag kalimutan, no? laging may du, laging merong dx. Okay? So, mapapansin nyo, everything in our given integral is taken care by the substitution technique. So, yun nga, itong 2x minus 3 times dx, naging du. And then, yung ilalim, magiging u. Right? Yeah, this is integrable already. This is 1 over u plus c. And then, babalik lang natin yung nilet natin, which is x squared minus 3x plus 2. Ah, 1 over u, mali ako. Ano ulit? Ano integral ng du over u or ng 1 over u? Ellen u, sir. Ellen u. Pag may nakita kayo mali, sabihin nyo agad. Baka kasi hindi ko mapansin. Buti nang pansin ko agad. So, Ellen u. Let's see. So, napaka-simple kung yun yung example. Pero, what if ang binigay ay ganito? I don't know, no? I don't know. Balikan natin ito mamaya, itong problem na ito. Kasi hindi designed eh. What if ang binigay is not 2x minus 3 above? Si uh, bagoy ko lang sa nang nang konting konti. Kung binigay ganito, it's not 2x minus 3 but 2x plus 3. Hindi na hindi na over in substitution kasi pag niyo mo nga in denominator. Ang di yun 2x minus 3 a plus 3 yun. So what do we do? Awa ba yan, guys? So here comes the technique of partial fractions. Okay, so babalikan ko yan. Tingnan natin if we can have a time to answer this modified question. Pero I have designed problems na nandiyan na as an example and as an exercise too. Now, the technique of partial fractions, ang dami niyang cases, guys. Ang dami. Bali, pero hanggang apat lang yung i-discuss natin. Apat na case, no? Uh, categorize into two major case. Ayan, sabi yan. Uh, two major case. Una muna. Non-repeated factors. Kung ano yan, maintindihan nyo, pag nag-start na tayo, non-repeated factors. And then, may sub-case yan. Sub-case, uh, ayun na lang. Linear. And then, quadratic. Okay. 
factors. Or factor lang. Then quadratic factor. Or factors, pwede rin madami. Then second case, I repeated. So repeated factors. Sabi ko nga, apat na case. Categorized into two major case. Subdivided into two cases, bawat isa. So yung una, linear and quadratic. So repeated linear, repeated quadratic, then non-repeated linear, and then non-repeated quadratic. Basically, hanggang dyan lang ang inaabot. Hanggang dyan lang yung yung uh, kinocover ng mga tertiary ng college. Hindi na nagbibigay ng cubic factor. Medyo masalimuot na siya. No? So, okay. So, let's start by a simple example. Yan, ang liit, no? So, kita ba? Yes, sir. Yeah. Now, gusto ko lang iulitin na okay na sana to eh. Tapos na sana ang problema. Kung ang binigay sa atin ay 5x over x squared minus 9 dx. Kung ito yung binigay, walang problema kasi kayang-kaya to ng substitution. So, gawin natin by substitution. u is x squared minus 9. What is du? When? What is du? When? When? Parang lag si Gwen na. Ah. Sige, Gwen. 2x. Eh. Oo, ulang ka naman. 2x what? Implicitly both sides with respect to the differentiable variables on both sides. D. Okay, laging may dx. Oh, now, kung makikita nyo, that, five, that constant 5 can be put outside. That's a property of an integral. Pwede labas yan eh. So, may hindi nito siya. x, x squared minus 9, and then dx. Kung ayaw mong i-divide doon ng 2, okay lang. O, di, gawin mong 2 yan, dapat mag-divide yun ng 2 outside. So, nakuha na naman yung du, ito na naman yung u. So, magiging ano na lang to guys. After the substitution, 5 halves. du over u, which is 5 halves ln u plus c. At babalik ko lang si x squared minus 9. Nakuha ba yun? Yung nakuha ba yung segue? Ah, segue lang yan. No? Kaya nga buburahin ko agad. Eh. Okay ba? O, oh, yan. Now, ang technique of partial fractions is first step, make this fraction into a sum of simpler fractions. So, you can see the denominator, parang wag muna natin intindihin yung integral sign. As you can see, that 5x plus 3 over x squared minus 9, pwede siyang i-express as yung denominator can be, can be factored. So, ganyan siya, no? So, factoring. Kailangan nyo mag-factoring. Now, kung yan yung factor, you know na parang LCD dati nga, no? Naka-times, tama ba? So, meaning, you can express this as a sum of two simple fractions whose denominators are the factors of your, den your, your the factors of the denominator. Whose the denominators are the factors of the denominator of the given rational function. So you have x minus 3. Now, why yan? So all we need to do is to get the value in above. Now, general rule in fraction, kahit elementary, tinuturo na to. We say a, pr a fraction is proper kapag yung numerator mas maliit sa denominator. Like 4 over 5. Right? Mga no, ganun. Yabang ni Ahapla, may sagot na to tsaka 3. Ah, yun. Nakita niyo yung chat ni Ahapla? O, oh, siyaan niya siya. O, oh, 4 pips. Ah, uh, general rule in partial fractions, the numerator must have a degree that is 1 or more degree less than nung nasa ilalim. So, ano yung degree nung ilalim? Di ba powers 1? So, dapat yung taas, 1 degree less. So, kung 1 degree less, ano yung degree ng taas? Zero. Yes, very good. O, oh, oh, mali si Apla, one daw. One yung degree ng ilalim. So, yung degree ng taas must be zero. So, meaning, kapag ang degree ng taas is zero, it means it is a constant. Do you agree? Kasi constant yung x to the zero. Eh. So, that's what we are, uh, that's our goal. 
kunin yung value above. So, we quantify those constants as capital A, capital B. Okay? So, basically, ito na yung technique ng partial fraction. Uh, ang galing, basically, pwede ko na nga itong ano yun. Uh, oh, dire, pwede mo diretso yun na kahit alam mo na, wag mo na isulat na ito. No? So, yun, yun, yun ang factoring naman. As you can see, ano yung degree nung ito? Ano yung degree nito? 1. Ano yung degree nito? 1 din. And they are called linear factors. So basically, nasa case number, 1 pa lang tayo. Linear factor. Okay? So both of them are linear factor. Now, ang next step is to solve for A and B is to multiply by the LCD. Obviously, ito yung LCD. To multiply natin by the LCD. By doing that, mo, wala itong denominator na to kasi nga yun, nga yun, dalawang yun. So you get this 5x plus 3 is equal to the LCD divided by x plus 3, matitira yung x minus 3, which you multiply to A. Plus LCD divided by x minus 3 which is x plus 3, which you will multiply to B. Right? Uh, now, siguro ganito yung ginawa ni Aplan. Uh, AX. Diba? When you multiply it, that's AX, right? So AX. When you multiply this, that, that's BX. And obviously, equal sa 5X yun. So let me write it. Hindi ko pala susulat. AX plus BX, 5X. AX plus BX equals 5X. So obviously, meron kong A plus B equals 5. Tama ba? Oh, now, how about the constants? When you multiply A to negative 3, you get a constant. Because you know that A is a constant too. So, yung negative 3a. So, sulat ko na siya. So, when you multiply b to positive 3, you get a positive 3b. And very obvious na malamang siya si 3. Kasi yun lang naman yung constant in the other side. Do you agree? So, what, what, what will result is that you will have a system of equation. Again, yan. 5. Then, divide this by negative 1, uh, by positive 3. So, negative a plus b equals 1. So just add and solve the system. You get 2b equals 6, or b equals 3, and a plus 3 is 5. Obviously, a is 2. Follow, follow that. Now, one a. Oh, now, ang nangyayari would be, you know, you can now express the given rational function na kinuha mo yung integral into sum of two simpler fractions. Right? Both looks. Yeah. Now look at what will happen. Dito, hindi magiging ano yan. Ano yung nakuha natin A? 2, right? Ano yung nakuha natin B? 3. Right? So this thing is equal to 2 over x plus 3 plus 3 over x minus 3. You can check if you want. If you add this, it will result to that. Now, property of the integral, that the integral, parang derivatives lang. Ano ba derivative ng sums? Sums of derivatives. Actually, galing pa nga sa limits yan eh. Deri sum, uh, derivative ng limit ng, uh, derivative limits ng sums equals sums of limits. So it follows derivative of sums equals sums of derivatives. It follows the integral Integral of sums equals sums of integrals. So meaning, pag in-integrate in natin to, equal yan sa sum ng dalawang integral na tau. So let me write that now as integral 2 over x plus 3 dx plus 3 over integral 3 over x minus 3 dx. Tawa ba yan guys? So meaning, babalik at babalik ka sa substitution. Good thing, if you let this as your u, Ha? Sulat ko lang. If you let the denominator as u, what is du? dx. Actually, 1. 1 dx, right? So, meaning, walang worry. Pwede mo nang idiretso. 2 ln, or the natural logarithm of x plus 3. Plus, ano yung integral ng 3 over x minus 3? Go ahead. Blay, go ahead. Integral of 3 over x minus 3. 3 ln x minus, quantity x minus 3. Uh, in some books, and siguro, warning lang yaps yapan at sa Ateneo, parang absolute value yata gusto nila. So, sundin mo lang yung gusto nila. Okay? 
Oh, bawa absolute. You know, you know why? Because the logarithm, the proper, the logarithm requires that the right side should be positive, right? Yun yung domain niya, right? Uh, old school lang yun. Uh, now, plus C. Pero may mga libro naman na hindi naman kailangan. Okay, one big five. Yeah. So you see that this is a good, this is a, uh, the pinaka simpleng example na mabibigay ko about uh, linear factor. Nabibigyan ko kayo ng konting shortcut, no? Na hindi na kayo magsisystem. So balik ako sa, sa na ba yun? Okay, nakopy ako yung alawa, no? Burahin ko muna itong slide na ito. Ang kailangan kong kopyahin ay ito. No, ito pala. Kaya may kinopya ako kanina. Inaayos so, siyempre para pagbigay ko yung file. Can you now open the files guys? Yung first two sessions na na-open nyo na ba? Sino nakaka-open na? Japan, na-open mo na yung sa'yo? O, oh, yan. Yeah. Diba? Kapag na-open mo na, you can see not yet, laba. Inuna ko yung partial fractions. Oh, no, look at this. Look at this. Uh, I want you to look at this. You don't need to do the system. Pero bawal kasi tong technique na to. No? Alam ni, ni, ano yan, ni Gwen kung bakit. Anong tawag ko sa technique na to? Babawal na technique. Kinagbabawal yung technique. So, ang gagawin mo lang, gagamitin mo yung bawal. Unang gagamitin kong bawal, gamitin ko sa 3. If x is 3, magsis 0 to. Kasi 3 minus 3, right? Eh, bakit bawal? Kasi nga, bawal sa denominator mag 0, di ba? Mag-undefined. Kaya bawal. Pero gagamitin pa rin natin. Pero huwag lang tayo maingay. Uh, yung, uh, sa atin, sa atin lang. So, if x is 3, magsis 0 to. Magiging yun na to, 3 times 5. Siyempre, x is 3. Magiging 15 plus 3, 18. At equal yan sa 0 to, 3 plus 3, 6b. What is b? 3. Done? Uh, now, gamitin natin yung isa pang bawal. x is negative 3. If x is negative 3, what will happen to this? Left side. Negative 15 plus 3. Negative. negative. At syempre, magsisiro to. Kasi is negative 3 plus 3. And here, magiging negative 6a. So what is a? 2. Done. Ito yun na nag-system. Okay? But pero bawal yan, ha? Pag gagamitin mo, titingin ka muna sa kaliwat ka na. Ito yung tao, ha? Yan, mga ganun, okay? O oh, now, oh, para practice, ito, pares sa pares lang. Pares linear factor lang to, guys. So, go. Sige, I'll give you some time. Kung may sagot na kayo, white lang muna kayo. Pwede nyo chat. Ay, wow, wag pala. Kasi pag chinat, hindi na magsasolve yung iba. Si Apla kasi, binigay niyo yung sagot agad eh. Baka may, meron dito, ano, pinapasiklaban. May pinapasiklaban ba si Apla? Wala naman, mga po, alas puro lalaki naman nandito.
Kung may sagot na kayo, uh, sabihin nyo lang sa chat, Dan, Dan, gano'n, Dan. Para lang meron akong idea kung marami na bang tapos, I can now start the problem. Yan, yan, that, like that. Kasi club talaga si Ahap na. So that's one third of one third. Tapos na. I counted it. Sampu kayo. Nakaps. Get it. Sige lang, laba. Mental, gaya. Diyan, gaya mental. Diyan, chat. Ano ito ba si Robby? Ah, okay. Dan na si Robby. The Matt Stone, tapos ka na. Okay, Sid. Sige, Carla. Kaya yan. Guys, kumakain ako, no? Kumakain ako. Kaya, hindi, pag sumusubo ako, kumakain ako. Kaya pag sumusubo ako, Ina ganun ko yung yung ano yung mic ay yung ano cam. Syempre pag daw mang inget, di ba? Net net ano ba tawag doon? Net net ticket ba 'yun? Parang ganun. Okay game. No. Kung mapapansin niyo guys, dapat sinusunod niyo pa rin yung mga batas ng classroom nung junior high na you can actually factor out one half outside para hindi maganda gulo-gulo x squared minus 4x plus 5 factoring pa rin right and pwedeng, pwedeng i-direction yun ah okay ginagawa ko scratch muna i-scratch sir yes minus 5x plus 4 ah baliktad sorry baliktad Oops, malakit pa tama. Maliit lang yung... Uh, uh, Minus 5x plus 4. Ang uh, ginagawa ko, ginagawa ko muna siyang sa scratch yung yung pagkuha ng A and B. Tapos, ididiretso ko na dito sa integral. Uh, so, A over x minus 4. B over x minus 1. LCD, so 5x minus 2 equals A quantity x minus 1 plus B. May I go out daw si Patrick. Okay, Patrick. You may go out. Paano ka mag-go out? Ayan sa bahay ka lang. Diba? Paano kaya yun, no? May go out. Ah, bibili sa labat. Eh, ano na? Carpio na, diba? Meron pa rin. Meron pa rin sa inyong time. Yung bawal nang lumabas ng 8. Yan. Face mask. But, Alam ko, bawal pa rin eh. Okay, so, yan, and then gamitin ang technique, x is 1, 
if you will be required to do the solution, kailangan pakita yung solution na systems, okay? Systems. Hindi ito. Kasi baka bawasan kayo ng points. Siguro pang check nyo na lang. 3, negative 3B. So get B equals negative 1. And then if X is 4, 20 minus 2 is 18. Not B0. This is 3A. So A is 6. So yun. Tama ba? Do we have the same? So mangyayari, this would be 6 over X minus 4. But don't, per don't, don't forget that 1 half is being multiplied to everything. So dapat 1 half integral 6 over X minus 4 DX plus may 1 half pa rin yan. Integral negative uh, 1 over that be x minus 1 dx. Okay? And ayusin natin. 1 up times 6, or the 6 outside, 3 na lang. Integral 1 over x minus 4 dx. And then plus negative, that is minus 1 half. Integral 1 over x minus 1 dx. So pag nag-substitution ka, let this be u. No? If this is u, sulat ko pa rin, wala naman problema because du is just dx. So magiging u, du over u lang to. Pwede mo na i-diretso. 3 ln x minus 4 minus ln x minus 1 over 2 plus c. Now, okay na ako sa ganito actually. Hindi ko na ipapatanggal yung fraction. Pwede na yan sa akin. Kung makarating yung teacher nyo, bala na kayo sa buhay nyo. Oh no. Do we have the same? Nakuha ba? Tama ba? O may nagkamali because of that one half? Okay ba yun? Okay. So siguro walang problema sa linear factor. Right? Kaya? Okay. Try this. Okay, isa pa ulit. Para satisfied ako sa linear factor. O go. Okay, in this problem, ilan ang linear factors nyo? Ilan, Matthew? Tatlo. So, tatlo. Pero guys, hindi tira na tira agad. Hindi porque rational, rational function. Gagawin mo agad lin, ano, partial fraction sa technique. Minsan, mabait ang buhay. No? Minsan, ang buhay mabait. Bibigay sa inyo ganito. Medyo hindi papahalata ng konti. So, hindi papahalata ng konti. And yan bibigay. So kung ganyan yan binigay, baka mga may partial fractions agad atake nyo. Pakiramdaman nyo din. Ah, pag niyo ko ang ilalim, syempre, you always, you always uh, see the very first technique if it can apply. Ay, wala palang DXL. Okay. What is du, guys? What is du? 3x squared minus 2x minus 2px, right? Kung mapapansin nyo, yung taas, 6x squared minus 4x minus 4, madadali siya just by simply multiplying both sides by 2. 2 du, 6x squared, buma, nagbabawi si up lang yan, tapos na. Minus 4 dx. E di dali na naman. So yung taas, ito, Mapapalitan ng 2 du. 2 is a constant. I'll put it outside. Du over u lang yan. Yan magiging 2 ln u plus c. And then, babalik ko lang yung u ko. x cubed minus x squared minus 2x. Lagi mo titingnan baka pwede yan. Baka ganyan yung kasimple yung binigay. Gets ba yun? Kasi baka pag nakita ka ng ganyan, partial mo agad. Baka kaya ng substitution. 
Okay ba yan? O ngayon, obvious naman na hindi, tsaka mo gagawin ng substitution, uh, ang partial fraction. Kita ba, Nathan? Right. Oh, erase ko na. Dan na daw si Apla. Okay, tama na eh. Parang may pinapasiklaban na rin si Apla. Tingin mo, ano, Yaps, meron ba? Meron ba kung di alam mo? Tabago ba ta, ano? Apla, mag-video ka? Yan pa rin ba yung nakita kong naglalakad? Tapos, ano, nagta sa, ano, Makati? Yan pa rin yun, no? Ah, yan pa. Ano pa? Parang ano nga, himala ito, magal na one month ah. Siyempre hindi ka count yung quarantine. Kasi pag counted yung quarantine, mas malaki yung chance na maghiwalay dahil nakakita ka ng iba. Oo, di ba? Tawa si Blay. Blay, don't ano. Makilala si Apla. Kaya nag-enjoy sa mga contest yan, para lang makita ng mga iba eh. Ah, sige, if you're not yet done, I'll, let's, let's do it together. So, done na rin sa Robby. No one's asking Robby. Ay, wow, huwag yung ginaganyan yung intermed passer. Na kaya nag-intermed, pinag-trip pinag -trip lang daw siya. Gusto lang niya mapatunayan sa sarili niya na kaya niya mag-intermed. Kaya pa, abang talaga. Okay. So, tama ba yung factors ko? Tama. Tama, tama. Okay, and then of course, tatlo yung linear factor natin na hindi nagre-repeat guys, no? Yung nagre-repeat next meeting. Hindi kaya ng this, this day. As you can see, 20 minutes, nearing 10 o'clock na tayo agad. Wala pa akong quadratic factor. Ayan. So, constant, constant, constant. LCD, LCD, So, this divided by the x, matitira yung dalawa na ita-times natin kay A. LCD divided by x plus 1, matitira yung dalawa na ita-times natin kay B. Uh, wait, para consistent ako. LCD, matitira yung dalawa na ita-times kay C. Biglang nag, na, wala na ako ng space. Oh. Ayan. Okay. Now, kasha. Hello. Tatlo yung pwede natin gamitin. Umpisa ako na si 0. X is 0. 0, 0, negative 4. 0, 1. 0 plus 1. 0, 2. 2. Then, 0, 0. So, 0 na to. What is A? 2. So, this can now be written as integral 2 over x dx plus if x is negative 1. If x is negative 1, this is a positive 1 times 2 minus 1, that's 1 minus 4, negative 3. And magsisiro to because of that factor, magsisiro to because of that factor. Dito tayo, negative 1 times uh, negative 3, positive 3. So careful with the signs, b, 3b. B equals negative 1. So, if B is negative 1, actually, gawin na natin itong minus. So, minus the integral of 1 over x plus 1, dx. And, plus, and plus na din if x is 2, 2 squared 4 times 2, 8 plus 2, 10 minus 4, 6. 0 to, 0 to, this would be 2 times 6, 6c. So you'll get C is 1. So this would be the integral of 1 over x minus 2 dx. So be careful with the substitution. Pasok naman lahat yan. Pwede mag LN ng diretso kasi if u is x, d u is dx. If u is x plus 1, d u is dx. If u is x minus 2, d u is dx. Nasusundan ba ako guys? So this would, I'll write my final answer in white. This is 2 LN x minus 2 LN of the quantity x plus 1. Oh, hindi pala 2. 1 lang, ayan, minus ln lang, then plus ln of x minus 2, 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 plus ln of x minus 2,
plus C. Final answer. Do we have the same? Thumb, thumbs up sa mga na, nasa bid ko. Okay, good. Oh, no. Actually, I have another. Another. Pero mukhang satisfied na ako sa linear factor. Kaya iwan ko na lang sa inyo to for practice. So, kaya-kaya na to. So, punta na tayo sa case na actually, ito pa. No? May isa pa. Linear factor din to. So, dalawa yan eh. Pwede na lang natin balikan. Ah, uh, actually, wait lang. Nawala yung sa kong quadratic factor. Ah, ito. O, oh, ito yung quadratic factor ko. Ito yung mahabang sagutan. Inaano ko na ito kanina eh. Binivisualize ko na ito paano gagawin. Mukhang aabot tayo ng dito pa lang on this problem na lang. Me explaining it. Mga 10 to 15 minutes. 15 minutes moderate approximation. Now, sige. Pares naman yung steps. Pares naman yung initial steps lagi. Uh, we will try to express our rational function into a sum of simpler fractions. So we will factor out x squared plus 4. And, and you can see this is x, linear factor, guys. And then this one, x squared plus 4. Now, can x squared plus 4 be factored pa? Kaya pa bang i-factor si x squared plus 4? Hindi na. Si x squared minus 4, yes. But x squared plus 4, hindi na. Do you agree? And anong degree niya? 2. Guys, pwede kayo mag-mic off, ma mag on, tapos mic off lang. So, anong degree nito? Yan, yan. Mas maganda, may nagirinig ako. Anong degree nito? 2. 2, sir. 2. Two. Two. Pero itong degree na to, itong factor na to, hindi na factorable. This is when we call it an irreducible quadratic. O, di ba? Ganda. Parang ano, no? Dati, not factorable ang term. Ngayon, irreducible quadratic. Ha? Ibig sabihin, cannot be factored anymore. Ibig sabihin, yan na talaga siya as a partial fraction denominator. Wala na eh. So, ano yung, ano yung rule ko kanina? The numerator must be of one degree, a degree no. less or more. No? Pwede yung two degree less, three degree less, depende sa degree. So, ibig sabihin, the numerator here can be degree 1 or pwedeng degree 0. zero. Pero para ma, 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 ma doon, we can take care of any possibility. Dito, we have no problem. It's a constant. We are sure it's a constant. Dito, degree 1. We write it. That's correct for Vx plus C. Kasi pwedeng mag degree 0 yan. Kung makukuha mong x0, pwede degree 0 to. Right? Kung ang x mo, may, kung ang b mo may value, kung ang b mo may value, you, kayo, you will have a linear pa, linear sa taas, degree 1, degree 2, 1 degree lower. Kung ang B mo 0, magsisiro to, mawawalang X, C lang. So, degree 0, that's 2 degrees lower than the denominator. Nakuha ba yan? That's the rule, okay? 1 degree lower. Now, same steps, guys, same steps. Gagawin na natin. Actually, I can, I, ano, I allow, I... I invite you na kayo magtuloy. Same steps. Multiply by the LCD. Gamitin yung pwedeng bawal na gamitin. Parang mali. No? Parang mali yung sinasabi ko. Gamitin yung ba pwedeng bawal na gamitin. Parang mali. No? <laughs> Kasi nga forbidden. Pero as you can see, meron, 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 meron may problema. So, mga, uh, pakita ko na. By the LCD, 2x squared plus x minus 8 the LCD divided by the X, that will be A times X squared plus 4. The LCD times, divided by this, X matitira, it's quantity BX plus C. Don't forget quantity yan, eh? times X. Okay? At guys, isa lang pwede natin gamitin, si zero lang. Na bawal. Yan na. Eh? Isa lang pwede gamitin at bawal pa. Si X is zero. Right? Yabang naman yan, Robby, nangunguna. Nangunguna si Robby, nagchat na. So, if x is 0, magiging ano to? Negative 8. If x is 0, 0 na to. 
because zero yung x eh. Zero times this is zero. Pero zero plus four, four a. So may a na tayo. And a is negative two. You follow guys? Oh no. Wala na tayong pwedeng gamitin ni ba? So what we now do is inspect it term by term. So, oh, ayan. Mali yung kay Apla. Oh, bala kay mag-away. Makinig na lang kayo muna. Tinan ako sinang tama. Term by term. X squared muna. X squared. Ito may X squared to pag minultiply. So, A X squared. Right? Ito may X squared to pag minultiply. B X squared. Right? Eh, malamang, equal yan sa may X squared sa, sa kaliwa. Eh, ano ba yun? 2X squared siya lang naman. Do you agree? Ang oh, di mangyayari dyan, huwag mo nang pansinin yung X squared, huwag mo nang pansinin yan. You have this equation in terms of the coefficients. A plus B is 2. Eh, may A ka na. Negative 2. What is B? Negative 2 plus B, 2. What is B? Come on guys, pwede kayo magsalita. 4. Oh, yan. Sure. yan, mas maganda. 4. A is, A is, A is negative 2. B is 4. Uh, now, tasagot na pa. Huwag ka lang baka. Gulo eh. Apple, I just said eh. Oh no, C. C, C naman. Paano? Constant. Pwedeng constant yung tingnan o pwedeng yung yung ano, yung uh, yung may X. Kaso yung may X titignan ko yung may X. Kasi ito CX. So. Yan, may X yan, di ba? CX. Dito ba may X dito? E di, malamang, equal to sa nag-iisang may x doon. Cx is x. So, ano malamang itong coefficient na to What is c? 1. one. Malamang, 1x. So, kompleto ka na, guys. Ipa-plug in na lang natin yung detalye. Yan. A, B, C. So, pakitandaan, no? Negative 2, 4, and 1, respectively. Negative 2, 4. Buburahin ko na kasi yung solution sa baba. Pati yan, nabura. Pati lang. Diba? So, ang mangyari, ano yung A ulit? Gagawin na natin integral. Negative 2, right? But in the negative outside, actually, 2 can be put outside na. No? Yung buong negative 2 na. That's actually, that's actually, ah, uh, my practice. When I have a constant, I, I readily put it outside agad. Immediately put it outside agad. The integral sign. And then Bx plus C. Sino ulit yung Bx plus C? B is what? 4x plus 1. 4x plus 1. Parang ena naman si Apla. May, parang kanina may sagot na siya eh. Pero mukhang kaduda-duda yung sagot ni Apla. Oh yeah. Now look at this. Oh, apla, malayo. Oh, now, look. Wala tayong problema dito. Because that is simply negative 2 ln x. Right? Pero looks like may problema tayo dito. May problema tayo dyan. And we cannot use substitution, guys. Bakit? If u is x squared plus 4, du is 2x. Do you, you follow? So, i-highlight ko yung integral na yan, ha? Yeah, I like ko siya. Ayan, ibabox ko siya. Popocus tayo muna ngayon dyan. At babalikan natin yung sagot dito mamaya. Popocus tayo dyan. Next page. Kaya nga sabi ko kanina. Inano ko, uh, tinatansya ko kung gano'ng kahaba sagutin ko. Mukhang sabi ko nga, ito yung ending. Dito tayo matatapos. Highlight natin yan guys. Yan. And... Look at what will I do? I will uh, separate the integrals because 4x plus 1 over a, a denominator pwede yung i-express as integral 4x over x squared plus 4 dx plus the integral 1 over x squared plus 4 dx. Nasusundan? Guys, Yes, sir. Ito, kaya by substitution. Kasi if u is x squared plus 4, that's the reason why I separated the two. Because I will sub use substitution sa una. If u is x squared plus 4, du is 2x dx. As you can see, kaya ng substitution ma-take care 
itong part na to. Because I will simply multiply both sides by 2. 4x dx na. Nasusundan ba? So, mangyayari si 4x dx magiging 2 du. So, gagawin ko na siyang integral 2 outside du over u. Over u. Nasusundan. And magiging 2ln na na siya. 2ln u which is x squared plus 4. Nasusundan ba? Uh, now, plus, ito ang problema. I-highlight ko ulit siya. Uh, highlight ko naman in blue. Okay na eh, no? May kulang na lang to, May kulang. May kulang. Pag, uh, meron na tayo ng una nito. Ito siya. Yes, very good, uh, Kurt. Di, kinonect ko lang to sa problem na nag-end tayo last time. Actually, yun yung dinirive ko last, ta last time. Notice the form. Dinirive din natin yung form na yan last time. Ano yung form na yan? Ah, wait, mali ako nang kinapi. Mali ako nang kinapi. Yan. So, buburahin ko na naman yung iba. Iiwang ko yung blue. Tsaka yung red. Yan, iwang ko yan. I need the space for my solution. Remember that integral 1 over a squared plus u squared du equals 1 over a arctan u over a plus c. Nalala yung form na yun at dinerive natin last time? Oh, tell me, what is a? Laging sinusulat ng simula yung constant. O, di sulat natin ng simula yung constant. Para makita nyo at masundan ng madali. So malamang ang a squared 4, ang u squared x squared, ang du dx, right? So all we need to do is follow the form and 1 over a is 1 half. Arctan, u over a, syempre u squared is x squared, therefore u is x. So magiging x over, x over what? Over 2. And Let's see. So, yan yung gagamitin ko. Ilalagay ko sa previous. Ladagdag ko doon. Tapos, ilalagdag ko sa previous to get the final answer. Nakuha ba yun? So, ang daming steps na nangyari, pero dapat uh, nasusundan. Kaya ang ginagawa ko, ganyan, hinaano-ano ko siya. Pinapart by part ko siya. Yun nga lang, minsan, baka mamaya nakalimutan nyo na. Kung nga pala, may nakuna pala, hindi ko nasulat. Mga ganun. Ayan, ito siya, ano? Final slide. Final slide. Ayan. So, lagay na natin, guys. Una, ito, naging dalawa siya, no? Which is, ah, uh, ito. 2 ln x squared plus 4. Ayan natin. 2 ln x squared plus 4. And then, yung iniwalay natin ng 1 over x squared plus 4, naging arctan. So, 1 half arctan plus 1 half arctan of x, of x over 2 plus c. Ah, no, not x plus 2. Tama, x plus 2. Tama ba? x over 2 plus c. Nakuha ba guys? Yan ang ibig ko sabihin. Hindi porke nagbagong teknik na E eh, kakalimutan na yung ibang techniques at yung ibang forms. Are we clear guys? Tuloy-tuloy yan. Tuloy-tuloy. Kung mabait ang proof nyo, allowed kayong magkaroon ng copy ng formulas. Kung mabait. Kung, kung, kung ano ka, ma, malasim ka, paktay, kailangan kabisado mo yan. Pero again, kaya naman. Kasi kapag lagi mo sinasolve, nasasanay ka na. Parang si Kurt. Ah, art fan yan. Nakita, nakuha ba yun? So, wala pa tayong arc sine and arc cosine. So, uh, familiarize yung forms nila. And then, this new technique. Remember, nandito pa lang ako sa non-repeated factor na linear at isang example na quadratic. Yun nga lang, yung nag isang example ka ng irreducible quadratic which so happen na x squared plus 4, eh, kailangan dumaan sa arc tan. Oh, sino mga nakaisip na kailangan i-break down yung 4x plus 1 into 4x plus 1 na dalawang integral? Those 
yung mga techniques na yan. So, I know, medyo mabigat sa simula kung baguhan, no? Pero practice lang yan. So, medyo napagod ako kasi nga, talagang iniisip ko, ilang problem lang yan. Iniisip ko na agad, no? Haba naman ito. Ayun, parang next time, bago tayo pumunta sa, pwedeng ganito, bago ko dagdagan, bago tayo mag, mag, mag uh, repeated, practice pa tayo, practice muna. Pwede ba yun? No? Yun. Huwag muna tayo mag-repeated. Uh, papasagot na ako ng mga, ano, ng mga uh, problems na magsisimula sa madali, 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 medyo kaya-kaya, and then yung mga, merong challenge. Okay? Sabi ko sa'yo, mali si Apple eh, kasi, Apple kasi. Okay? Okay ba guys? So, yun muna, no? Yun, yun, yun dito lang muna tayo. So, See you next meeting, guys. Okay. Good day. Good day, sir. Okay. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.